Special thanks to David Min for recommending me to do a tutorial on this mod. What is going on everybody? It is Sam here, and today I will be showing you how to install the Godzilla mod for Minecraft 1.7.10 on your Mac. Here we go. So the first thing you have to do is open up both links in the description below. The first link should take you to a Minecraft forums thread, and the second link should take you to the Minecraft Forge 1.7.10 page. Let's start with the Minecraft forums thread. So scroll down on the thread until you find a link under downloads and under another thing that says the latest version. Click that link. Then where it says click here, press click here and then wait for the skip add button to appear in the upper right hand corner. Once the skip add button appears, click that. Then press the big green download button on the Mediafire website. An advertisement will open up, simply close that, then close the Mediafire link, then close the Godzilla mod downloads link, then close the Minecraft forums link, and just leave the Forge page open. And drag, let's minimize Google Chrome or whatever browser you're using, Let's drag our mod to the desktop real quick. Now let's reopen that to our Forge page. So you should already be on the 1.7.10 page. With that being said, head under Download Latest and click Installer. Again, a Skip Add button will appear in the upper right hand corner. Once the Skip button has appeared, click that and Forge will download just like that. So let's get out of here. Now let's drag this file to our desktop. Now open up your Minecraft application. Under Profile, click New Profile and name it 1.7.10. Then under Use Version, select Release 1.7.10, then press Save Profile. Select the profile in your Profile drop-down menu and then press Play. Once your Minecraft Start screen has opened up, select Options and select Resource Packs and click this button that says Open Resource Pack Folder. This should take you to a finder window that opens up your Minecraft folder and application support. Minimize this window, we are going to come back to this later. Now in your Minecraft application, quit out of it and open up your forge installer.jar. Select open. Make sure install client is selected and make sure it is going directly to your Minecraft folder, then press OK. If it successfully installs, you should get a little window that looks like this, press OK. Now let's drag the forge installer and the log file that was created off of it into the trash. Now let's open up Minecraft again. If we click on the profile menu, a new forge profile has been created. Click on that, then press play. Once that is complete, press quick game. Now let's reopen our finder window that we had open before. And as you can see, a new folder has appeared in the Minecraft folder that says mods. You are going to drag your Godzilla.jar mod into this folder. Now let's get out of here and let's reopen our Minecraft application once again. Make sure the Forge profile is selected, then press play. If we look under our mods menu, we can see that the Godzilla mod has been installed. So let's open up a brand new single player world. I'm gonna call it, I'm going to call it Godzilla. And here we go. So as you can see, I'm in the world holding this really cool spawn egg that says spawn Godzilla. If you go into your creative menu and, and select miscellaneous, you will get the option to spawn a Godzilla egg. And then of course, if you keep going, there is another tab for the Godzilla mod, which are all of these other really, really cool things you can use. All right, so I'm going to put on armor that looks like this because this is looking pretty sweet. I'm going to wear this. This actually looks awesome. As you can see, there's a little particle effect going on and I'm just going to spawn Godzilla. Sorry about that, I had to turn the sound down. I'm afraid that I might get a copyright claim for the Godzilla sound. But other than that, there it is, Godzilla, ladies and gentlemen. And um, let me see, there was another really cool spawn egg that I wanted to try out, um, Burning Godzilla. Let's see if these two can have a battle. I'm not quite sure, but let's try it out. Ooh, but I'm on fire. Oh my goodness, look at these two. This is incredible. Wow, 
All right, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, the Godzilla mod for Minecraft 1.7.10. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave a comment below. I will do my best to answer it. Also, if you are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you want to stay tuned for more cool content. And if you really enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button down below as well. All my social media websites are listed in the description below, so if you're not following me on those, please do so if you want to stay tuned for video updates and other cool stuff. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I am Sam, and I'm signing off.